Lance Henriksen, a man of humble beginnings, has made an indelible mark in the world of acting. Born and raised in New York, Henriksen defied the odds and built a successful career in Hollywood, appearing in over 200 films and television shows. His breakthrough role came in the 1980s as the Android Bishop in the Alien franchise, a performance that solidified his place in science fiction history. Henriksen's talent extends beyond the camera, as he is also a skilled painter, sculptor, and writer. His art has been featured in galleries and museums across the country, and he has published several books, including a memoir and a collection of poetry. Despite his many accomplishments, Henriksen remains humble and dedicated to his craft, always pushing himself to take on new challenges and explore new creative territories. His story is a testament to the power of hard work, determination, and a relentless pursuit of one's dreams. Lance Henriksen is a well-known actor who has been active in the film industry for several decades. With a career spanning over 50 years, he has made a name for himself through his diverse and powerful performances. He is best known for his role as Bishop in the Alien series, but his resume includes many other notable appearances in film and television. Despite having been in the industry for so long, Lance Henriksen remains a relevant and respected figure in Hollywood. His enduring qualities include his intense and unique acting style, his versatility, and his ability to bring depth and complexity to any character he plays. We want to know what you think makes Lance Henriksen such an everlasting symbol of the industry. Do you have a favorite performance of his? Which work of his do you hold closest to your heart? We would also love to hear about any memorable experiences or personal connections you have with this classic star. Share your stories and memories with us in the comments below. There are many surprising and fascinating facts coming up about Lance Henriksen, so be sure to keep watching this video. From his humble beginnings to his rise to fame, there's no shortage of intriguing stories about this talented actor. Lance Henriksen, born in New York in 1940, had a challenging upbringing. His father was an artist and his mother a nurse, but they separated when he was young. Henriksen spent his early years moving between family and friends, living in various parts of the U.S. This nomadic childhood gave him a wide range of experiences and a unique perspective on life. Henriksen's introduction to acting came in his teen years when he joined a traveling theater group. He was captivated by the power of storytelling and the connection he felt with the audience. This experience ignited a passion for acting that would shape his future. While working as a carnival barker, Henriksen met James Dean, who encouraged him to pursue acting. This brief encounter had a profound impact on Henriksen and further solidified his desire to become an actor. Later, Henriksen moved to California and studied at the prestigious actor's studio, where he honed his craft under the guidance of influential figures such as Lee Strasberg and Aaliyah Kazan. These mentors helped Henriksen develop his unique acting style which combines raw emotion with a quiet intensity. Henriksen's early exposure to diverse experiences and people, as well as his mentor's guidance, have significantly influenced his successful career as an actor. His ability to bring depth and authenticity to his roles has made him a respected figure in the industry and a favorite among audiences. Lance Henriksen is a well-known American actor known for his work in film and television. He has appeared in over 200 projects, with some of his most famous roles in the Alien series, The Terminator, and Pumpkinhead. For those new to Henriksen's work, Alien is a must-watch. In this film, he plays the role of Bishop and Android, and his performance is both chilling and memorable. The Terminator is another classic in which Henriksen plays a small but impactful role as a detective. Pumpkinhead is a horror film in which Henriksen gives a standout performance as a vengeful father. Other notable films in Henriksen's filmography include Near Dark, Hard Target, and The Quick, and The Dead. In Near Dark, he plays a vampire with a heart, while in Hard Target, he plays a villainous character with relish. The Quick and The Dead is a western in which Henriksen plays a supporting role, but his performance is memorable. In addition to his work in film, Henriksen has also had a successful career in television. He starred in the series Millennium, for which he received an Emmy nomination. He also had a recurring role in The X-Files and appeared in Bag of Bones, a miniseries based on a Stephen King novel. In conclusion, Lance Henriksen is a versatile actor with a long and varied career. 
For those new to his work, Alien, The Terminator, and Pumpkinhead are great places to start. His performances in these films are both memorable and impactful, and they showcase his range as an actor. Lance Henriksen, a talented actor, discovered his passion for acting while growing up in the Bronx, New York. He was inspired by the vibrant atmosphere of the city, where he witnessed many actors and performers showcasing their talents on the street. One day, when he was just a teenager, Henriksen stumbled upon a local theater group rehearsing a play. He was captivated by the energy and intensity of the actors on stage, and he knew that he wanted to be a part of this world. As he grew older, Henriksen began attending acting classes and workshops, where he honed his skills and developed a deep understanding of the craft. He was particularly drawn to the power of storytelling and the ability to transform into different characters, which allowed him to explore various aspects of human nature. One pivotal experience that fueled Henriksen's desire to pursue acting as a career was when he was cast in his first professional play. He was nervous and uncertain about his abilities at first, but as the rehearsals progressed, he became more and more confident in his skills. The thrill of being on stage, connecting with the audience, and bringing a character to life was an exhilarating experience for him. From that moment on, Lance Henriksen knew that acting was his true calling. He has since appeared in numerous films and television shows, earning critical acclaim and a loyal fan base along the way. His undeniable talent and passion for his craft have made him a respected and accomplished actor in the industry. Lance Henriksen is a father of four and a grandfather of two. He has two daughters, Sage Ariel and Alchemy, and two sons, Thiai and Lawrence. In his spare time, Henriksen enjoys pottery, a hobby he has pursued for over 40 years. Henriksen is known for his role as Sergeant Neff in the film Damien Omen Roman II. However, he was not a fan of the final product and felt it did not benefit his career. Despite this, Henriksen has had a successful career in acting with numerous film and television credits to his name. Lance Henriksen, a well-known actor, faced numerous challenges in his early career. Born into a poor family, he experienced financial struggles and worked various jobs, including as a roofer and a short order cook to make ends meet. Despite these hardships, Henriksen's resilience and determination led him to pursue his passion for acting. In the industry, Henriksen encountered skepticism due to his unconventional looks and lack of formal acting training. However, he used these perceived weaknesses to his advantage, developing a unique and authentic acting style that set him apart from his peers. Henriksen found creative solutions to overcome obstacles, such as seeking out roles in low-budget films and off-Broadway productions. He also took advantage of every opportunity to learn and grow as an actor, observing and studying the techniques of his more experienced colleagues. Through his persistence and hard work, Henriksen eventually gained recognition and respect in the industry. He became known for his ability to bring depth and complexity to his characters and for his commitment to his craft. Today, Henriksen is celebrated as a talented and versatile actor with a career that spans over five decades and includes numerous memorable performances. Lance Henriksen, known for his role as Sergeant Neff in Damien Omen Roman II, had planned to portray Neff as a Vietnam War veteran, mentoring Damien. However, the original director, Mike Hodges, left the production and Henriksen felt ignored by the replacement, Don Taylor. Despite this, Henriksen bought a television for the Military Academy's cadets, showing a connection with them. Henriksen's career includes a three-year stay in Borneo during his childhood, which may have influenced his worldview. In Tales from the Crypt, Henriksen appeared in two episodes, Cutting Cards and Yellow, showcasing his versatility as an actor. Despite the challenges faced during the production of Damien Omen Roman II, Henriksen's performance remains noteworthy, and his appearance in Tales from the Crypt further highlights his talent and range as an actor. His experiences in Borneo may have added to his depth as an artist, contributing to his unique perspective and approach to his craft. Lance Henriksen's career has been marked by several breakthrough moments that have showcased his versatility as an actor. In the late 1970s, Henriksen's role in the film Dog Day Afternoon, directed by Sidney Lumet, was a significant turning point. 
His performance as a SWAT team member left a lasting impression on critics and audiences alike. In the 1980s, Hendrickson's career reached new heights when he was cast as the lead in James Cameron's The Terminator as the relentless and unstoppable cyborg, the T-1000. Although his role was eventually given to Robert Patrick, Hendrickson's portrayal of the villainous character in the film's opening sequence was still noteworthy. However, Hendrickson is perhaps best known for his role as Bishop in James Cameron's Aliens and its sequel Alien 3. Bishop is a synthetic human and a fan favorite character, and Hendrickson's portrayal of the character was highly praised. Cameron has been quoted as saying that Hendrickson brought a warmth and humanity to the role that made Bishop a standout character. Hendrickson's body of work in the 1990s, including the TV series Millennium, for which he received an Emmy nomination, and films like Hard Target and The Quick and The Dead further solidified his status as a talented and respected actor. In recent years, Hendrickson has continued to work consistently in film and television with notable roles in shows like Bag of Bones and The Blacklist. His contributions to the world of acting have been significant and his impact on the industry continues to be felt. Lance Hendrickson, a seasoned actor, is known for his role as Emil Fauchon in the 1993 film Hard Target. In the same year, he starred in Nights, directed by Albert Pion, who had previously worked with Jean-Claude Van Damme and Cyborg four years earlier. Hendrickson's acting career includes notable roles in various films, such as his portrayal of Vukovic in The Terminator. Interestingly, he was one of several actors, including Michael Douglas, Kevin Klein, Sylvester Stallone, Tom Selleck, Randy Quaid, and Lance Hendrickson, who were strongly considered for the role of the Terminator. Before his acting career, Hendrickson had a few run-ins with the law. At the age of 17, he spent four and a half months in Miami's Dade County Jail for being an accomplice to a vehicle theft and eluding police in a car chase. Additionally, he served a short stint in a Tucson, Arizona jail for vagrancy in 1960. Despite his troubled past, Hendrickson's talent and dedication to his craft have earned him a respected place in the film industry. His contributions to cinema continue to resonate with audiences, leaving a lasting impact on the world of film. Lance Hendrickson is an accomplished actor known for his distinctive and intense performances. He approaches his work with a deep sense of preparation and commitment, often immersing himself in the character's background and psychology. Hendrickson's style is characterized by his ability to convey raw emotion and vulnerability, making his performances feel authentic and powerful. His personal experiences and worldview are often reflected in his work. Growing up in a broken home and facing various challenges in his early life have given Hendrickson a unique perspective on the human condition. He often portrays characters who are struggling with their own demons, and his performances are imbued with a sense of empathy and understanding. Hendrickson's artistic vision is shaped by his belief in the power of storytelling to shed light on the human experience. He approaches each role with a sense of curiosity and a desire to explore the complexities of the human psyche. Whether playing a tough-as-nails marine in Aliens or a tormented artist in Pumpkinhead, Hendrickson brings a unique sense of depth and nuance to every performance. In addition to his work as an actor, Hendrickson is also a talented visual artist. His drawings and paintings often explore themes of nature, spirituality, and the human condition, reflecting his deep connection to the world around him. Overall, Lance Hendrickson's unique style and approach to acting are shaped by his personal experiences, his worldview, and his belief in the power of storytelling to connect us to one another. His work is a testament to the enduring power of the human spirit, and his contributions to the world of cinema will be cherished for generations to come. Lance Hendrickson, known for his roles in various films, nearly secured the lead in Robocop. He is also memorable as Vukovic in The Terminator and as Bishop II in Alien. Contrary to popular belief, both Hendrickson and Bill Paxton survived their encounters with Terminators and Aliens on screen. During the production of the Alien Quadrilogy DVD box set, technical difficulties arose in restoring certain scenes of Alien. Some scenes featured poor quality dialogue recorded on set and the team lacked the time and budget for re-recording. As a result, subtitles were inserted where dialogue was difficult to hear. However, for the 2010 Alien Anthology HD Blu-ray box set, original actors, including Hendrickson, were brought in for additional dialogue recording 
improving the soundtrack's quality. Lance Henriksen is a highly respected actor known for his work in films like Aliens and The Terminator. He's contributed significantly to the industry with his unique acting style and ability to portray complex characters. His contributions have not gone unnoticed, with many industry experts and fellow actors praising his work. Henriksen's impact can be seen in the acting techniques he's popularized. He's known for his ability to convey deep emotions through subtle facial expressions and body language, a skill that has influenced many actors who followed. His commitment to his roles, often involving intense physical and mental preparation, has also set a high standard in the industry. The characters he's played have often been nuanced and layered, contributing to the trend of complex character development in modern storytelling. Henriksen has the ability to make audiences empathize with even the most unsympathetic characters, a skill that has inspired many writers and directors. In an interview, filmmaker James Cameron, who worked with Henriksen on Aliens and The Terminator, said Lance has a rare ability to bring depth and humanity to any character he plays. His performances have added so much to my films. Actor Michael Bean, who co-starred with Henriksen in Aliens, echoed this sentiment, saying, Lance is a true artist. He's not afraid to take risks and dig deep into his characters. He's a huge influence on me and many other actors. Henriksen's influence extends beyond film and into television and voice acting. His work has helped shape the landscape of storytelling, leaving a lasting impact on the industry and inspiring generations of actors, writers, and directors. Lance Henriksen is known for his acting roles, such as in The Terminator, but he also has a passion for working with Clay, which he has pursued since 1960. In 2017, he launched a website to display his ceramic creations and finds homes for them. Henriksen believes in the simplicity and beauty of raw clay and compares potters to nomads constantly searching. In an interesting turn of events, Henriksen was never meant to be the Terminator, but James Cameron based early sketches of the character on his likeness. To pitch the film, Henriksen dressed up in a leather jacket, added cuts to his head, put gold foil on his teeth, and stormed into the Hemdale front office, making the staff uncomfortable. This bold move helped Cameron and Heard secure the film's production. Henriksen's love for vacationing in Hawaii is well known. He finds relaxation and inspiration in the tropical paradise, making it a regular destination. In summary, Lance Henriksen is a multi-talented individual with a passion for acting and working with Clay. His creativity and unique approach have made him a memorable figure in the film industry, and he continues to push boundaries in his artistic pursuits. Lance Henriksen, known for his work as an actor, has a deep love for nature and animals, which often shows in his work and personal life. He's an outdoorsman who enjoys hiking, fishing, and horseback riding. Henriksen has a respect for the environment and is concerned about conservation efforts. This passion has led him to participate in various environmental campaigns and use his platform to raise awareness about preserving nature. Apart from his acting career, Henriksen is also a talented artist. He creates sculptures and paintings, often inspired by his life experiences and the natural world. His artwork has been featured in galleries and exhibitions, showcasing his creativity and unique perspective. Henriksen is also passionate about giving back to the community. He has been involved in various philanthropic efforts, including supporting organizations that help people dealing with homelessness and substance abuse issues. He believes in the importance of second chances and providing opportunities for those in need. In addition, Henriksen is an advocate for animal rights and has worked with organizations dedicated to protecting animals and finding them loving homes. His compassion for animals extends to his personal life as he shares his home with several rescue animals. Overall, Lance Henriksen's personal values and interests, such as his love for nature, art, and giving back to the community, are essential aspects of his life and career. These passions have shaped his work as an actor and influenced his involvement in various causes and philanthropic efforts. Lance Henriksen is known for his memorable roles in various films. In the blockbuster hit Aliens, he played the character Bishop, and interestingly, he's not the only actor from this movie to appear in the Terminator series. Michael Bean and Bill Paxton also appeared in the Terminator, while Jeanette Goldstein was in Terminator 2 Judgment Day. 
Henriksen's role as Wally Skura in The Right Stuff was more subdued, with limited dialogue throughout the film. Despite his minimal input, he still managed to leave an impression. In Damien Ullman Roman II, Henriksen portrayed Sergeant Neff, but his experience on set was less than ideal. He didn't get along with the director, Don Taylor, making the shoot a miserable experience for him. Henriksen was originally hired by the original director, Mike Hodges, who was later fired. Overall, Lance Henriksen has had a varied career in film, with some challenging experiences along the way. Lance Henriksen's legacy in the acting industry is marked by his remarkable versatility and enduring commitment to his craft. With a career spanning over five decades, he has left an indelible mark in both film and television, captivating audiences with his powerful performances. Henriksen is known for his intriguing ability to portray complex characters with depth and nuance. From his iconic role as Bishop in the Alien franchise to his chilling performance in The Terminator, Henriksen has consistently delivered compelling and memorable performances that have transcended the boundaries of genre and medium. When asked about his future contributions to the industry, Henriksen remains humble and focused on the work at hand. He continues to seek out new and challenging roles, always eager to push himself as an artist and to contribute to the vibrant tapestry of storytelling in the entertainment industry. As for aspiring professionals, Henriksen offers the following advice, stay true to yourself and never stop learning. The industry is always changing and you need to be adaptable and open to new experiences. And most importantly, never give up on your dreams. With hard work and dedication, anything is possible. Henriksen's own career is a testament to the power of perseverance and the importance of staying true to one's artistic vision. His contributions to the industry will continue to resonate with audiences for generations to come, inspiring future generations of actors and filmmakers to pursue their own creative passions. Let's take a moment to appreciate the remarkable career of Lance Henriksen, a true veteran of the entertainment industry. With over five decades of experience, Henriksen has made his mark in both film and television, showcasing his impressive talent and versatility. From his early roles in movies like Dog Day Afternoon and Network to his iconic performance as Bishop in the Alien franchise, Henriksen has captivated audiences with his powerful presence and compelling acting style. He's also known for his work in television, including his Emmy-nominated role in Millennium and his recurring appearances in shows like The X-Files and Bag of Bones. Henriksen's work has transcended genres from science fiction and horror to drama and action, leaving a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. His contributions have helped shape the creative landscape, and his legacy is one that will be cherished for generations to come. So, let's hear your thoughts on Lance Henriksen's work and legacy. What are your favorite roles or performances? How has his career influenced your own creative pursuits? Share your memories and reflections in the comments below. And if you enjoy this content, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more. Let's celebrate the creative spirits that shape the entertainment we love.